Oh, hey there, my Virgo babies. How are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. If you've not been here before, please like, share, and subscribe. Join my weird little tarot family. If you guys want a personal reading, info's in the description box below. If you guys want to see this very cool romantic tarot that I'm using today, unboxed in its entirety, it's by Los Carabeo and it's beautiful. You can do that on my other channel. That info is in the description box as well. All right, Virgo, let's see what's going on with your person. What does Virgo need to know the most right now? What's going on with Virgo's person? Page of Pentacles, interesting. The world, the world in reverse. They want to have a conversation about why this ended. This page of pentacles energy gives me five of pentacles energy. This person's like singing for their supper. They feel very destitute. They feel very left out. I get Pied Piper energy. They want to like lure you in. A lot of them are wanting to have a conversation about money or about you know, like something that happened here. Some of you owe, they, they feel like they're owed money. I don't know why. They're also trying to call in abundance for themselves. They realize that the decision that they made with this has left them, you know, kind of like destitute. Page of Wands with that. Wow. I feel like this person's like, this is some John Cusack energy with the in your eyes. <laughs> Where are my old school people at? What's that? It's not say anything. Does it say anything? I forget what the movie is, Lloyd, Lloyd Doppler with the boombox, you know, playing In Your Eyes by Peter Gabriel, standing outside the girl's window. That's what this is, playing the music, carrying the flowers, you know, trying to lure you in. Somebody wants to change somebody's mind. I also take a separate reading here that this person is choosing to date around right now. This double pages, this is somebody who's just entertaining options, having a lot of conversations, but not choosing anybody with judgment in reverse. It's like somebody who just is, you know, continuously swiping. I was going to say swiping, uh, swiping on a dating app. Two of cups. Why is that here? Knight of wands in the reverse. They can't have what they want. They know who they want. They're hiding feelings for who they actually want to be with. Two of cups. They're separated. I think both of you are hiding your feelings from each other. Knight of wands in the reverse. It's like a mutual energy of two people being very childish. Yeah, fool. Let's just say the childish and it's fool in reverse. You guys didn't start off honest with each other, all right? I feel like you guys were coming at each other like two pages. Instead of like actually having a, a grown-up conversation about your emotions, you guys like got in some petty drama here. This energy feels very childish. It feels very high school to me. I don't know. I'm just getting high school bullshit with this. It's like, oh, I have feelings for you. I like you. So I'm going to throw a rock at you. It's like that kind of shit. It's like playground stuff. Someone's making poor choices. Just making poor choices. <laughs> wow. The world. So they got judgment in reverse and now they have the world upright. They want to end that cycle. Being childish is getting too fucking burdensome. Look at that. It's great you're the child and you're the king of the world. It's like you guys are playing king of the mountain. You guys keep trying to shove each other off. It's like you guys are having a pissing contest. You guys are coming as two heavy masculine energies. There's not a lot of feminine energies here. That's buckling whatever this is. This childishness is what's going to end this. I feel like you're dealing with a fire energy. Or you guys have fire really heavy in your charts or something is going on in your Leo house. I don't know what's up with that. It's like there's this competition between the two of you. Nine of cups in the reverse. Petty. Ace of wands upright. Five of pentacles in reverse. I felt that five of pentacles in the very beginning with the nine of pentacles. It's like you two don't want to separate, all right? But you also don't want to commit. But at the same time, you feel lost without each other and you want each other, all right? But neither one of you do anything about it. It's like there's a strong mutual attraction. It's like you hate to love this person. You don't want them to know that you have feelings for them and they feel the same way. 
but they very much you guys very much pay attention to what each other are doing and i'm getting a mutual with this all right i'm sorry i say what i see i don't sugarcoat shit for you you're both engaging in this behavior i feel it heavily and i feel like it's escalating and i feel like it's going to end this relationship someone's going to take it too far neither one of you are coming completely correct here three of pentacles in reverse look strong man competition you're trying to like out muscle each other it's like i'm a bad bitch i'm a bad bitch and it's like it's just like stop like why you're all trying to like prove to each other how much better you are than the other person when like all you really want is the validation from each other which is like the stupidest thing ever <laughs> It's like you just try to show how much better you are than them when all you want them to do is think that you're the best. And they're doing the same thing to you. This is like really childish high school. Too. High priestess in the reverse. Like y'all are just being like, I'm sorry, Virgo, whatever. Y'all are being like stupid. I don't think anyone's even being honest in this situation at all. There it is. Leo energy on the bottom. Strength card. Y'all trying to fucking out muscle each other. You guys are like trying to show off or something to try to like get this person to, you know, come get you or to, you know, force them to rope them in. It's like just showing off your energy there. I don't like it. I feel like you're both doing it. If it doesn't come natural, stop trying to force it. And y'all just need to stop, start being honest. You're coming at, you know, each other like two pages. You just cut to the middle of the deck for no good damn reason. And then we have the three of swords. Fucking with these other people and these other energies and these people that you really don't care about. And trying to flex on, you know, your person or their, them doing this to you with other people is going to dead this relationship. It's going to end it. So cut it out. Cut out the childish shit. All right, y'all. That's what I got for you. Love you, Virgos. Bye.